Welcome at the ESC Congress in London. My name is Ewa Jankowska and together with my two colleagues, Dr. Markus Wolner and Dr. Rafael Vidal Perez, uh, we represent the Cardiologist of Tomorrow Nucleus. Cardiologist of Tomorrow is the initiative which is aiming to bring young people closer to ESC activities, to let young people interact between each other, to enable them to know about the possibilities which ESC offers regarding educational, education and science. Uh, Rafael, mm -hmm. how did it start? It was a long time ago. No, it, it was near uh, 2010. It was the first idea. They gathered some national societies that had a group for young cardiologists. And then the thing goes, go, how to say, very fast, spreading through Europe. And now we have 35 countries with national representatives for the young. I think it was very, very nice. And we were adding people to the nucleus, different people coming every, every year. And for example, it was nice to meet Marcus also there in this adventure. Thank you, Rafa. So I perfectly remember when I heard the first time of Cardiologist of Tomorrow, it was in 2011. Uh, I followed an invitation of Rafa and the ESC nucleus to the European Heart House. And to be honest with you, I had absolutely no idea Oh, what is this all about, COT? And after that meeting, I have to admit that I really liked the idea of having a young, strong and motivated community and I was very much in favor to contribute it. And then the, for me, the journey started that in 2011. It and you ever? Uh, it was also a long time ago. I remember when I replaced some other people from the nucleus. Uh, when together with some other people join your group. But I think what is also something really important in this initiative that we are trying to interact uh, with other subspecialties mm -hmm. uh, within the ESC, which I think is extremely important. We are connected with ECHO people, with heart failure group. Uh, do you think does bring any benefits to our younger colleagues? I think I think it was it was it was nice. The first one were echo, but now more things are coming, and the last one are the heart failure people. And I think Marcus has also many. I think the hot group is developing mm -hmm. really rapidly recently, doing a lot of initiatives. Exactly. So when we started, I guess the COT was the kind of the base for all these other young subspecialties. Now we have seven subspecialties, and. HOT initiative is for heart failure specialists of tomorrow. And the nice thing of these seven groups is that they all try to work together. So last, uh, yesterday actually, yesterday. we had the meeting with the subspecialty groups and it was fruitful. It was nice to talk, to know each other, to talk about career, projects and corporations. And a very great thing for me is that within this community, projects and international corporations have been established, what I think is really a, is a, a great thing. Mm -hmm. uh, I think we are happy what we have now, but definitely this is not, not the end. No. Uh, do you think that we could spread further our I think, I think message? We, there are tools and uh, useful. That we, we are starting to use new, new, more, more tools. Uh, for example, we have the, the, the newsletter to communicate all, with all the members and also through the national leaders. That is uh, something really essential because the cut started with the national, at the national level with these young groups and we have to keep them uh, updated. I think uh, Marcus uh, has some role on that. Exactly. So we are trying to, uh, to get the people involved. and it's, At the beginning it was not that easy to find the right tools, but in this time it's getting more and more easier since we use social media mm -hmm. and we use emailing groups and I really like the idea of the community itself. I mean we are involved in the scientific program then the ESE offers many many different things and grants for the young people especially mm -hmm. uh, but what I really like is the community itself that we know each other that we meet each other that we talk about career and that we work together and that's what I like most with the Very young community. community. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. So uh, we can say that uh, Cardiologists of Tomorrow has been one of the most successful 
uh, initiative which has been launched by the ESC. We are happy that we are here. We see that a lot of young people benefit from this initiative regarding their clinical experience, research projects, also regarding networking and socializing between us, which I think is also important. So welcome on board to everybody and thank you very much for a nice talk. Thank, thank you. you.